Northern Japan this morning on uh, 40 meters. Whatever. We got work to do. Come on. Ugh. We got mail to open. My good friend GS in Australia sent me this and I want to show you. I don't know. It looks bent. Let's see what this is all about. Uh, sure is watertight. I think he taped the entire thing. Yep. He sure did. Rusty Thistle is the name of his business. So let's see here. feeling this is gonna be special well he did a fine job wrapping this look at this Oh my goodness gracious. Look at this thing. I hope I'm getting it on the camera. Look at this magnificent sheath. It's got my logo in there. Beautiful artwork here. And a saltwater crocodile embellishment. That is amazing. Look at this. Beautiful. Full grain Australian cowhide. We got the straps here. This handle is amazing. Look at the thickness of the tang. Old saw blade. I think from the 1800s out there in Australia. Okay, you guys ready? Oh my goodness gracious. Would you look at that oh oh my goodness let's check the edge on this thing huh gs this is beautiful. Oh my goodness, that's razor sharp. And it's built to work. Oh yes. Craftsmanship. Look at these rivets. Beautiful, beautiful work. GS, thank you so much. I'm so glad it came here. Straight as an arrow. Uh, 
it'll break in nicely. So where should we put this thing? Huh? This has got to be one of the best conversations on ham radio I've ever found. Oh, look at this. It's going to fit perfectly. Hey Robert, I just unboxed my custom made machete from Australia. He's got a saltwater crocodile embellishment on the sheath, my logo from my YouTube channel. It's beautiful. You got to see this thing. Oh, this thing is stout too. Got a great weight. The handle is carved to fit the grip. I don't know if you can see that on the video. And the wood is beautiful and it smells. Oh, it smells good. Look at that. It's built for work. And the blade, old metal like that, I'll tell you, you need to follow this guy on Instagram and take a look at his work. Rusty Thistle Workshop, I think. Rusty Thistle. Look at that. Beautiful. I love the saltwater crocodile thing. You know? It's amazing. Amazing, brother. Amazing. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. All right, so let's take a look at camp here. You've probably seen the antenna there. That's for comms. There's a wire going across the trees here. I don't know if you can probably see the center insulator right there. The feed line coming down into the tent, which is on the jumping jack trailer. And I'm getting made fun of for bringing the easy up to keep the sun and the rain off of the quad. That's it. We're out here west of the Royal Gorge. Royal Gorge, Colorado. Everybody's out on their ATVs doing a quick run. We got done with a 50 mile, 60 mile trek yesterday. 60 miles, I think that's about 100K. There's a deer kill out that ways. Down that way. Bones and fur, I think it's a deer. It could be an elk. Pretty big spine, it's all bleached. Pretty old. And this is my house. Here come the boys. So fire service roads over the other side of the trails go on for miles and miles. GS. My man, my man, I love the thing, love it. And I appreciate everything you did, all the love and care you put into it, and the blood, and the sweat, and the tears. Here comes Robert, so I'm gonna show it off, then let everybody see your handiwork. Thanks, buddy.